present also the uh, another uh, study program in relation to healthcare information and communication technologies, which is the Masters in Life Science Informatics. I'm presenting it on behalf of my colleague, uh, Professor Melanie uh, Kaplan, uh, uh, who is the um, uh, uh, coordinator, uh, the program head of Life Science Informatics. Unfortunately, she could not could not join us join us today. Today, and I will be presenting on her behalf. So much of information here is very much similar to what I've just uh, told you about Masters in Digital Health. It's also an MSc program. It is also a, a full-time Masters. It also lasts three for three semesters to a total of 90 European credit points, 90 ECTS. And it is also being taught, uh, taught in English. It also begins in winter semester, which, which means that the application period is now and running until mid-July. And it is also a study program which is taught, uh, I should say, completely for free because we, we should not really uh, consider the 62 euro um, organizational um, fee uh, per semester because this is not really a tuition fee. Now, what are the admission requirements for MSc in Life Science Informatics? Also, essentially, very similar to what we had in digital health. Also, completed studies in either natural sciences or informatics with a bachelor degree. Here, of course, the focus is a little bit more on um, biological sciences or natural sciences. Uh, however, uh, medics uh, as well may apply here as well. Uh, the requirement here is also English uh, at an excellent level, very good level, C1. Um, and uh, additionally, uh, these the, the students are also um, uh, best to demonstrate some basic knowledge of uh, German. Uh, as an additional uh, um, a wish, not as a requirement, but a wish, it's good to have also some basic knowledge in molecular medicine, as well as or and basic knowledge in uh, programming or informatics. Here you can see on the left side the list of subjects or courses which are covered by this program. It's biomedicine and informatics, uh, informatics, biostatistics, data management, data mining, data visualization, life science, bioinformatics, and eventually also uh, master's thesis. Most of the modules uh, uh, are completed with uh, exam, mostly written exams. There are also two uh, term papers or seminar papers as a mode of examination, and of course, the final master's uh, thesis. So the focus of this um, study program is very much in the bioinformatics, which means analysis of mostly genomic data uh, in order to remember, we spoke about genomics and personalized medicine. So bioinformatics is the subject or subdiscipline within the uh, wider, again, area of digital health and medical and health, uh, biomedical and health informatics that is mostly concerned with identifying mm, the um, uh, links between various uh, genetics traits and the genetic uh, genetic uh, um, uh, uh, genetics and various disorders. So very much uh, it is focused on biomedical data analysis through the so-called next gen next generation sequencing. There is a huge amounts of data now uh, gained from sequencing of um, genome from decoding of genetic material and that information that data must be processed and correlated with also with clinical data in order to make it usable and to incorporate the genetics in order to predict the development of various diseases predict the responses to various treatments and that is ladies and gentlemen what we essentially refer to as personalized or precision medicine, which is indeed the future. So the computer-based analyses identify and analyze genes that are predictive for prognosis or for specific response to particular therapy in a particular disease. 
So this study program, in essence, focuses on uh, knowledge of medical and scientific basics in combination with application-oriented computer science knowledge. Uh, the, the perspectives, the, the important features of this master's program are practical lab experience in collaboration with University of Erlangen, Institute of Biochemistry, which is one of the major schools a little bit up north in North Bavaria, as well as collaboration with Institute of Molecular Pathology in Degendorf, lectures from different companies, uh, also possibility of virtual lectures, possibility to obtain ECTS through some related courses and also to uh, engage in an internship or to do also an internship abroad. This is also a possibility in all our study programs. And a master thesis, just like elsewhere, can also be written in cooperation with course-related companies. The main career directions here for masters in life science informatics are in bioinformatics companies, those companies which essentially do that next generation sequencing, next generation sequencing, sequencing of genome, and finding the correlations between genome and uh, diseases and conditions. But also the, any other biotech companies, biomedical industry, clinical uh, or scientific research institutions, pharmaceutical companies, because most from big pharma and not only, uh, but any pharmaceutical companies, many of them are currently engaged in very active bioinformatics research, as well as, of course, the possibility to work in academia and university, and even a possibility to engage in a PhD level research. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have more questions in relation to Masters of uh, Life Science Informatics, you, you're uh, seeing here the um, email address of Miss Juliane Breit, who is the uh, uh, study uh, assistant, uh, the, the uh, program assistant of Masters in Life Science Informatics, as well as uh, the general uh, email address for general inquiries. On that, I would like to thank you very much for your attention.